I was sincerely humbled and privileged to help launch the Australian Leadership Index in July 2019. I had an ever-deepening concern about declining levels of leadership both in Australia and overseas. My thoughts and ideas were nothing more than my opinion. These ideas undoubtedly have to be challenged and unpacked as they rightly should be. But an hypothesis is exactly what it's meant to be, a supposition made on the basis of limited evidence as a starting point for further exploration. My name is Steve Graham. I'm not an academic, but rather a layman, retired civil engineering contractor and venture philanthropist. So why am I addressing you? Simply because leadership is not the property of anyone, but the people. It's the people who must anoint saviours and leaders. The days of self-anointing saviours and leaders has come to an end if humanity is to survive its success. The Graham Foundation funded this leadership research. The mission was to provide a catalyst for a change in how leadership is viewed and perhaps reinvented in Australian society and perhaps beyond. The concept of leadership for the greater good is what we are really promoting. The index is designed to draw people into discussion about what leadership is or what it isn't. We hope this tool will become indispensable for people looking for solutions to life's critical problems. Unfortunately, it doesn't. Instead, it opens up Pandora's box. The more you dig into it, the more questions you raise, the more conversations you need to have. The more conversations you have, the more likely we are to find solutions and ways forward. It would be extremely difficult to have a discussion today about climate change if the thermometer had never been invented and records kept. Likewise, the index is a measuring device invented at the Australian Leadership Index at Swinburne to measure public perceptions of leadership for the greater good and convert these perceptions into measurable, recordable numbers on an ongoing basis into the future.